Hello, how's it going guys? Thank you for watching for this video. We're gonna do a taste test on this right here. It's a cookie and it's from No Foods. It's a chocolate chip cookie. I got it on the July Keto Crate box. Uh, I'm excited about this because I like cookies. Te gusta margaritas? All right, Yay. and uh, looking at the website right here, it says that they're worth $3.50 and they do offer 50% off through the Keto Crate offers. One thing that's interesting about this cookie is that even though it says only three grams net carbs, the back says uh, total carbs, 26 grams, five grams fiber, 19 grams of sugar. And right next to that, I guess they figured, okay, that doesn't look right for keto friendly, right? So it says uh, 19 grams sugar, question mark. And it says, it's not what you think. 18 grams of the sugars are alulos, the sugar-free sugar. It has a zero glycemic impact and tastes amazing. So I never heard of this alulos, but with 19 grams, that would take me out of my 20 uh, grams total for the day. So if it's actual sugar, then it's gonna make my head hurt, uh, just because I already know, I've been strict for a little while now. Uh, but if it's not, then it should be okay. So we're gonna experiment. So before I open this, let me get to the nutritional facts. It says serving size, two ounces, uh, and one of these is one serving. So that's 190 calories, 16 grams of fat, 26 grams of carbs, uh, which I guess uh, with the fiber and the one gram of sugar, three grams, or where it says right here in the front, three gram net carbs, and also seven grams of protein, right? The top ingredients is almonds, alulos, chocolate chips, and um, alulos, cocoa butter, water, coconut oil, egg white. All right, so let's open this up. Okay, the smell, it's really earthy, really kind of nutty. It's an interesting smell. It doesn't smell like a chocolate chip cookie. What is it? It, it almost smells like grain, like some type of a grain. I'm not too sure. But it also doesn't look like a chocolate chip cookie just because it's kind of uh, moist a little bit, a little soft. And so it's almost like a, what's what kind of cookie is soft like this? Yeah, so I'm not too sure, but it doesn't really look like a chop chocolate chip cookie. But we're gonna try this. The texture is really soft. It broke off really easily. It doesn't it doesn't crumble, so that's pretty good. I got a little bit of Okay, so let me try this. Mm. It's an interesting flavor. It kind of has that uh, fumey type of, of feel. She doesn't like it. It's an interesting flavor. It doesn't taste bad. It tastes weird. But it's a li it's um I don't I don't know. It's almost like I'm trying to think of what it tastes like. Like it has like wheat type of smell and taste. It doesn't have a chocolate chip, a chip cookie taste. It also has a little bit of an aftertaste, like a artificial sweetener, maybe like stevia. Yeah, so it tastes more like seeds and wheat than like flour chocolate chip cookie. So. It's not my favorite. I probably wouldn't buy it again, but not because necessarily it's bad. It's just I'm not used to that type of flavor. The texture is nice, but yeah, it's a little bit different. I mean, I'm glad I tried it, but I probably wouldn't buy it again. So that's it, a really short video on this. Uh, let me know if you tried this before, what you think about it in the comment section below. If you know of another cookie that maybe is a little bit better that I can try, do a taste test on, let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel. I got a bunch of videos coming up, so don't forget to hit that notification bell so you get notified when new videos pop up. And besides that, I really appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.